Hello everybody and welcome back to Factory Town. My name is Twister and today we are once again back in our beautiful, beautiful town with a beautiful, beautiful bridge right over here. We have conquered the other side of the river. It's now accessible to us, which is quite, quite lovely. Of course, if we wanted to, we could have also just made this into like a land bridge. But personally, I think this looks so much cooler than having a normal land bridge. And what I thought that we could do is we could actually go over here into our build menu and we have some decor. We have a wooden fence we could add. How would that look? Can we actually add it on top of the bridge over here? We can. But unfortunately, it is not at the edge of a block. It is in the middle of a block. So I'm not actually blocking a large part of our bridge over here. So I'm not going to be doing that right now. Because I don't think that's a good idea. So what do I want to do with this town? Well, I want to actually stop relying on the workers so much. Because they, they look cool. They're nice. But they're also horribly inefficient. They look good when they're just putting stuff in a chute. But when they're carrying stuff left and right on their own, I don't think that's very, very good. So, from now on, I'll try to use them uh, very, very little. Oh god, what's going on? You... Okay, we are out of uh, crops. Which is bad. That's like super bad. Alright. My, 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 my dudes, my friends. You're trying to carry... Okay, you're trying to carry crops. Just carry all these things over here. I'm gonna just reassign you over here. I know I just said I don't want to use them as much, but these guys are just idle. I'm not gonna like, buy new workers, I think. When I have to when I have to get new workers, I think this is what they're doing, right? They're gonna be able to yeah, carry, carry some grain back. That's great. You are using, I think, grain as well, right? I wish they told me what the their last job was. I wish there was like an easy way to do that. Okay, what are you trying to do? Same same thing, really. Okay, let's just do this. Okay, so many workers just doing nothing. So the idea is, we're gonna get some silos going over here. We're gonna put everything, sort everything in silos, more or less. We're gonna have a nice little uh, little barn over here. For things and that's gonna be great so let's actually get to work so we have some air systems over here i don't know what these are for yet they probably need research for it also research machinery which is gonna unlock conveyor belts and auto harvester we already have conveyor belts but we don't have the ability to make because we need cloth so we got a pasture over here the pasture has infinite water because it's on the river and our goal is gonna be to make it make wool right wool and fertilizer that's gonna give us fertilizer to make farm tiles to make farming more efficient also gonna give us some lovely, lovely wool. We can use in a workshop over here. That's the kitchen. We can use it over here to make... Mm, where where they... We made cloth and we can use that cloth to make cloth conveyor belts. Which I think might be really good. Because we think we want to start relying on shoes, start relying on conveyor belts. It might take a lot, like a large amount of production, but I think we can do it no problem. So like these are quite, quite close. That's not ideal, but it's fine. So while we wait for things to happen, I am just going so unhappy, that's so bad. While waiting for more things to happen, God, everyone's grumpy. We're gonna fix that. So over here we're gonna be making animal feed for a pasture. We're gonna need some grain for that. So the idea is more or less this. We're gonna have a silo. I don't think silo's gonna break a game again. I think we're gonna be fairly, fairly safe with that. Where was the silo again? All over here in the buildings. Let's go find a silo. Of course, get a forester going. We'll get that soon. You go a silo. We can also use a well for water, but the thing is, uh, wells need an area that they take water from. If you have like four wells in a circle, they're gonna be basically operating at one quarter deficiency because it depends on how many tiles they have access to. They're not access by their wells, that's how much water they get. And they also take some time to refill. So that's very efficient. It's a lot better to just have your things on the coast. It's a lot easier to do stuff like that. So okay, let's get a silo going. So I want to have a silo over here that's gonna rely. I want to have several silos. Let's have one silo over here. Near this stuff over here. Let's actually get... So let's turn some of these workers. You know, just start picking stuff over here. So just put it in the silo. Uh, it does have an arrow. We can just rotate it wherever we want. I think you can just, like, get stuff out of here. Can we, can we use a chute for that? Let's see. Actually, I wonder if we, like, get a chute adjacent to it. Is it gonna connect? Is it gonna start getting stuff out? Because it might actually start taking stuff out automatically. I think we'll get an item that does that for us, though. I don't think it's gonna do stuff on its own. So let's see what this dude does. I'm gonna pick up some lovely green, put it over here. Oh, it does go out automatically! That's actually amazing. Oh my god. I was not expecting that. I have... Oh, I have an, oh, I have an amazing idea now. <laughs> I have such a good idea right now. Okay, we're gonna get another... Okay, I, I everything... Oh, it's just... I. This is so cool! I did not expect that to work. That's amazing. We're gonna get another silo over here. Is the idea. We do want to use conveyor belts as well. We definitely do want to use conveyor belts. Can we... Before we do anything else. Can we just... Uh, I'm gonna try something. 
let's wanna, wanna try removing these shoots for a sec. So what if we actually go build, let's get some scaffolding blocks. If we had this and if you get a, let's see, let's get a shoot. It does not, it, do, it doesn't go out. Maybe it's too tall. Maybe it has to be at the bottom. Try moving this. And let's actually try removing one of these things as well. Uh, I gotta, how do I have to remove these? I forgot. It's been a few days. Sorry. Catholic block. We're gonna just right click to remove. There we go. If you get a shoot over here. I wish there was like an easier hotkey for this. We need to go A and get a shoot over here. Maybe it doesn't put it out automatically, but maybe it has to. Maybe it has to be at the bottom. Which sucks for me. That wasn't what I had in mind. Can we remove these things? We cannot. Have to actually first get these things out of the way. So, uh, and I try one more level. Use conveyor belts as well, which would be great. So let's actually go over here. Remove, remove this. Get build. Go go into the build build menu. A shoot over here. Oh, okay. This one does work. So we can do it like that. Want to have it a bit higher? Um. Just want to have a road underneath, if possible. Is this gonna be fast enough? Is the question. Probably not. Cause I'm trying to like figure out a way. So let's just do it like this. Let's uh, we can we can change. Now we know we can use one level. That's what I wanted to find out. We now get just a normal shoot path. There we go, like this. All right. So it, it, we can make it work somehow. It's gonna be easy once we get proper conveyor belts. You know, we, we'll get there soon. Let's not worry about it too much. I get this cleared out. Get some shoots over here. So these are gonna go out normally. So the idea is. We can always like have like a path go over it. I'm gonna have these go like over here and over here as well. So now when this thing gets filled up, they're gonna turn into the cellar, right? Now once once we reach, it's actually making stuff immediately, which is awesome. Once it gets filled up completely, all the extra grain we have, and we're gonna have a lot. Of course, we could just use one cellar, but I think this is a lot cooler. All the extra grain that we don't need for the grain mill. Is gonna go inside the silo, and we could actually actually just uh, like get another farmland over here. We can like re we can terraform easily to get uh, water access. That's in problems. Let's actually see what happens. Is it, uh, it's gonna work the way I expect it to work? So now we should turn right. Am I correct? I am. All right. So now, as long as this thing is full, it's gonna go. But does that mean if we have an arrow here? Does that mean if we get another shoot over here? Oh, it does actually work like that. Oh, my lord. So things put out stuff automatically. I didn't know that. Now I know. You can just go... Okay, 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 okay. okay. You're gonna rotate you a bit. Uh, oh, yes, we have actually exits on both sides. That's actually amazing. Uh, I didn't know that they put out stuff automatically. That's actually awesome. All right, and now we can add... Oh my lord, this is gonna be so good. We're gonna have stuff come out on the other side. Okay, I, I didn't I didn't know that. Like, I thought you had to have an item to pull stuff out. Like a special construction, but it just puts stuff out automatically. This is, like, opens up so many new possibilities for me. That's amazing. Okay, all of you just go do stuff over here. Our people are kind of unhappy. We're gonna start moving you over here. We're gonna start using for other things as time goes on. I, I don't care. Yeah, I don't want to hire any new builders. I want to just... Revamp my things a little bit. So over here we are making animal feed. That is great. Because we can do this. So we have a, one pasture over here. Do we want to have two separate pastures? We might want to have two separate pastures. Let's actually stick with one for now. We can, again, we can easily change things around later on. And this would go out automatically, right? And we can just do things like this. It's gonna go into here. Oh, it's so good! So now what happens? We get all the grain into the silo. The silo just throws it out of here. It goes into the grain mill, and that converts it into animal feed. If, for some reason, we are completely backed up with things, it will not convert it into animal feed. It's gonna go into this storage silo that we can carry stuff back over there. How amazing is that? Alright, you're gonna actually move a few more dudes over here. So they have to... We have to have the dudes pick stuff up to use it. Alright, that's good. So silos are actually amazing. I guess barns do the same thing. Man, my whole world is just blown right now that's so cool all right so we have things coming in here you are actually making wool which is pretty darn cool i like that so we're gonna be making wool over here it's gonna give us wool and fertilizer hmm the thing is how do we split those do we have a splitter of some kind because if we just get a, at a shoot what's it gonna throw out if we get a shoot over here 
Oh, it doesn't throw out anything. So this doesn't work. So this one doesn't work. Even though it has an arrow. Alright, so that that's okay. So now it's gonna get backed up quickly. That's gonna be great. So we will have to get... I think it's because it has multiple items that we can take. Because we have... Like, over here we only have... Animal Fear coming out. But hopefully it doesn't ever use these. Hopefully it's, like, smart enough to just put out the, the output. But since it has two outputs, I guess it doesn't know what to put out. So that's why we probably need some other lo logic item to move things out. So we have a fertilizer and we have patches. Can we use stuff from over here? Then we can use stuff from over there. So what we're gonna need is... We're gonna need... Let's let's see. Let's, let's think. So we have a lot of things over here. Let's actually get two more silos. I think silos are amazing. Let's get a silo get several silos over here. So when I have one... Again, I don't think we have to worry about space on these guys. That much. Um, can we use items stored in silos? I don't think we can. We can try. Because over here in the barn, as it says, we can use these items. Shared storage inventory. Does not use share okay, does not use shared inventory. So that actually won't work uh, for what we want. But we can do this. We can actually hire a so again, don't hire workers, just recycle them to something else. So you okay, you're idle now, that's actually awesome. What you're gonna do is you're gonna go over here. We're gonna deliver wool to this thing for now. Because it's actually super close. And this guy is gonna deliver this thing to this silo. And we're gonna have a separate wagon over here. It's gonna take Stuff from this one, just gotta wait for it to come up. We're gonna take it to a barn. I, I gotta actually make it go over the bridge, even though it's probably not as efficient. It's gonna look a lot cooler. Hmm. Can we get this across the river easily? But since we're making, like, grain over here, I also wanna have another grain mill, like, maybe on this area, it just moves around. Yeah, we can get some good things going. Okay, so you're gonna just take the fertilizer over here to, let's say, to this barn, because that's uh, the closest one we have right now. You can use shared inventory for that. Okay, okay, that's fine. Uh, again, people are getting angry again. That's perfectly okay. So we are making stuff over here. We're gonna actually just ditch all of these. We're gonna ditch the grain mill, gonna ditch the kitchen. We have a lot of fuel here. It's gonna come back, right? I think it'll just come back. We're gonna delete both of these. If it delete this, it's gonna go back to your inventory. It's gonna disappear. It's gonna just this go whoosh. You're gonna just disappear completely. All right. So we just deleted a bunch of resources. And speaking of being dumb like that's we were using that for stuff my bad my bad let's get a barn over here hit it back i'm gonna rotate it over here like that so yeah you my friend keep doing what you're doing again we are i know i wasted resources but i want to see what happened deliver deliver this over here it was super fast on the road that's actually awesome and uh, we also want to get a road going as well so you are actually harvesting stuff left and right. The problem here is that you are actually... That's a bit slow. That everyone's angry. That's okay. No biggie. So you can just keep transferring stuff. Hopefully this doesn't get filtered out. We can get a filter. Okay, so what we can store in here. Very interesting, actually. So we can maybe, like, use shoots to filter out stuff? I don't really know. I don't really know. It doesn't really matter. So we, what we have here... Is we have uh, some cloth. We are carrying that cloth. Actually, we're not transporting cloth. That's okay. That's okay. We're gonna transfer cloth from here. Wool. We need a workshop for that. I kind of want to carry it back to our main town. So let's actually use this, carry it back to our main town over here. That's great. Did I assign you to do that? I did. Good. And you are gonna just... What you're gonna do is since we have like a lot of things stored. This has infinite storage. What you're gonna do is gonna carry everything to this thing. So that's just to make sure that barn doesn't get filled up. That's gonna be your only job right now, because it doesn't really matter where it is. Uh, you just got bumped into one another, that's actually bad. So, of course, we have a lot of money. Gonna allow us to remove some resources. Not the best course of action. Not my favorite thing ever. What happened? Oh no! No! Another crash! Again, pre-alpha. It happens. So unfortunately we had a crash, as you noticed, and we didn't actually auto-save in the meantime because we didn't spend enough time doing stuff. That's fine, I just rebuilt all of this. So now we just gotta reassign some peeps to do some more grain mining. Is it called... No, it's not called grain mining. Grain mining, that's actually just dumb. So don't say that, that's a dumb word to say. Dumb word to use. Let's just transfer you over here. As well. 
There we go. And we wanted to actually clear out some of this stuff, right? Because that's what causes the problem. I think it might actually crash when, when uh, they don't know how to like go around. So make sure we, they have enough space at all times. There we go. Just clear all this out. Doesn't really matter. Just clear these herbs as well. No one cares about them at all. Are those are gonna leave? Because I don't know what they're for. But let's actually get some more roads. We do have enough mass for a road, I think. So let's just get a nice, lovely road over here. Unfortunately, I'm out of... Even, uneven terrain? Really? I don't like the sound of that. We'll fix that, don't worry. Have this over here. This might be a bit too close, but it's okay. Let's have more things over here. So it has like a double lane. We'll fix that later on. And it's uneven terrain. Never want to fix that. So let's go to the terrain. Let's flatten all of this. Mm, I think we gotta lower this. Hold on. Remove resources. Just get all of these out of the way. Thank you. That's a lot of money spent. And just want to... Lower these a little bit. Maybe because it's we can't do it because there's a road already there. That's probably the case, honestly. It's probably the case. Let's actually get uh, these roads out of the way. There we go. We should be able to just go flatten this now, right? Yeah, there we go. That's a beauty. All right. Gotta get some roads over here. Perfect stuff. That's a lot better. So, now we have a road. Uh, these... The barn is gonna get emptied out soon already. You guys are like not doing so hot. Okay, you my friend, what you're gonna do is you're gonna Okay, first first of all, we are we making stuff over here? Is this working already? It's not. Why not? Because it's oh, because I put the shoot in the wrong place, you dummy. You dummy twisted, you are such a dummy sometimes. That's okay, no big deal. We just get these rebuilt. And it should go out. Why not go out? Game. What have I done wrong? What did I do wrong? Oh, it's paused. My, my bad. <laughs> it was paused. Right. Makes sense. Now it's all going in. Awesome. All right. So now we're going to need some workers over here on this side. You are done. That's actually great to see. So we're going to carry wool over here and you are going to carry fertilizer over here. I'm going to have you carry stuff from this silo. Cannot navigate. Really? From this stuff to this barn over here. We have a lot more idle dudes. I'm gonna switch them again to our grain farm. We'll get, a, we'll get a farm going. Ideally, we'll like use, make, have a massive farm over here. We could do with some irrigation. We could just uh, like find a large flat area, like flatten an area and just have like one single river. Because we do want to have water for the farm. We could just have irrigation. I don't know if it actually like, drains the water out when it does it. I hope it doesn't, because that could cause us problems. But I think I have like a nice idea. I'm gonna basically just have a big line over here. We just have farms along that line. It's gonna be a lot of food coming in. It's gonna be great. We could do some awesome things here, I feel. Basically, if we add some variables, I think we have like a lovely design. A lo lot of stuff coming in. I don't know how much uh, how much the variables can carry and how fast they are, but we'll find out soon enough. How's our research doing? Machinery is at 27. That is great. All right. Just keep on making some wool over here. You're a bit slow, but that's fine. You're gonna get filled up over time. We can, of course, still drag things normally. And we will. But probably don't want to have this road as close. But it's just like a temporary fork. We're gonna just extend this over here into the, into the flat plains as time goes on. So grain mill, right now, the problem is not enough grain coming in. So this is not getting filled up at all. It has four, which is not enough. But I want to have more dudes doing some stuff here. So let's actually make you go over here. Of course, this will not last forever, but again, as I mentioned, the plan is to build things over there. And you, my friend, are gonna just carry everything over to our main storage, so this doesn't get filled up completely. I'm gonna carry some grain as well over here as well. Alright, so... Doing fine with this. When I get cloth, when I upgrade houses even more, but also when I get some food going, I think food should be our priority right now. I think we should try doing that. So the, th re the problem right now that I am having is no easy water access. How expensive it is to remove a block? Very. Well, not very, but it's gonna be a lot to get everything removed the way I want it. So, what I'm gonna do is like, there's like no nice flat area for me anyway that I wanna, that I can use. Because if, like, if this were all flat, that would be perfect, but it's not. And it's gonna give me some trouble. It's okay. Of course, you can, you can change the map generation when you start, but I added some hills to make shoots more e easy to use, but some things that are more difficult in return. 
So, what we could do, we have this coming in, we could just use a massive shoot to go all the way here. Hopefully it has like enough force to just go all the way here to this area that I don't want it to be at. It's gonna be, we could use multiple shoots as like stop points. I can build, I, I'm gonna build a kitchen here. I'm gonna build a kitchen over here, the farm, I guess. But, let's build it over here somehow. Let's, let's, let's flatten this area. Let's let's do this. Let's actually go over here to our terrain. Let's flatten this entire area. That's the plan. So this entire area is gonna get flattened completely. It's a lot of money. We're kind of low on money. We're gonna need to wait for more money. There we go. So what I wanted to do is something like this. Uh, terrain. It's gonna be like so tricky. So gonna actually lower. Before I do anything, how much, how big is the farm? Building? Can I even build a farm? Or am I too poor? I'm too poor right now. Oh, no. Produces grain enhanced by nearby farm tiles. We can do that. So it's uh, three blocks. We can put stuff out on this side. All right. So what I'm gonna do it like this. Basically, gonna have it near the edge over here, like in this area, and I'm gonna lower this entire section. Something like this. I'm gonna go into terrain, I'm gonna block, and I'll just lower these. You can see that the water is dynamic, it actually looks gorgeous. I think it actually is lowering the water levels a bit. I see a problem here. Can I undo stuff? I cannot. Because now we don't have enough room for it. Let's go belt over here. Uh, God. Can we just... Let's raise these. That's what I wanted. So like that. So this should all be water. If I go place a kitchen, I know I can't afford it right now in a bucket chimney farm. This is all gonna be watery now. So I'm gonna do it like this. Gonna have one on this side, the other on that side. That's how we can use the water to our advantage. We get some nice things going. So that's gonna be where we're gonna have our farms. We'll grow some lovely things. Game is paused. Don't be afraid. <laughs> it didn't crash again. You just pause it, twist it. It's okay. Your wagon's carrying stuff left and right. The problem with this one is not enough grain. We're just using it all up. So we need more peeps over here, if possible. Also, we need more happy people, because they're really unhappy right now. They're super unhappy, because they're low on food. Because we have, like, no food at all. Which is a problem. Um, I could just, like, replace this dude. With a simple... Thing. Like a simple shoot. Can I... Precise. Can we just rotate this? Remove. Remove. Oh, I can have it multiples at the same time, huh? Like this. And have one like this as well. So that should get stuff out normally, right? Even if I tell you not to do anything. So this should, like, give me flower. But there's, like, nothing to give, so that's kind of a problem. Alright, uh, again, we're gonna just get all this grain over here. Maybe there's like a way to limit the amount of stuff you get. Somehow, it's probably a way to make some kind of filter. Like have this and it gets split into two lanes, one lane goes for one thing, the other one for the other. I don't know, there's probably gonna be, there's gonna be a way somehow. These are gonna get filled up soon. So we'll, that's gonna be a filter of its own, I guess. As time goes on. This is all coming in, it's always full. We have less workers. But that's okay. So these, we're gonna have... So, uh, grain coming in here. The more people we have, these is gonna be. Of course. You are a, What's your job? I have no clue. You have a new job now. Actually. Let's just clear this out, because this is uh, kind of in my way. What do we have a lot? We have a lot of wood. What about this? We have all... Okay, you, you my friend, are not, like, not being useful at all, because you're just idle. So let's actually enforce you to do... Force you to do stuff over here. It's gonna be great. We do have enough to make a farm now. So we're gonna do exactly that. Let's go build a building. So we're gonna need a farm. Just like this. So I wanna have it be fa I wanna have it face this direction. Farm, it makes grain on its own. Which is why it's so amazing. Alright, my, my my friends, my dear friends, all of you are gonna be taking care of this. Can I just tell you to do this? You're gonna automatically go for it. You don't have to even drag, that's actually awesome. Just go go for this one, please, all of you. Empty this one out, because you're gonna be making grain, which is amazing. And it's gonna be a lot easier. We're gonna have a shoot over here. Oh, it's gonna go out. Oh, it doesn't even have to face the building. That's okay. So go all the way here. All the way into this thing. 
Um, I gotta wait for this to be harvested first. I think it's gonna be okay. And we might as well use conveyor belts. I think we can make two, afford two farms easily. Because it's it's beautiful, because it doesn't... It's like it's gonna be so much simpler than we we would have to like use our dudes to harvest this manually. A 28 over here. Probably shouldn't have built all of them, because now they have to wait to pick it up, but it's okay. It's fine. I think we're gonna be getting awesome, awesome, awesome things. This is piling up all of a sudden, so we are having enough production to actually go into this thing. Which means we can use this path to go into a brand new area. That's what we're gonna need. We need to actually save up some money. We will need another grain mill. And then we're gonna need a kitchen. And then we're gonna send that food all the way back home with our lovely carts. We could, of course, also use conveyor belts. Or shoots. Which might be more efficient. It probably is more efficient. But I like having cards go across the bridge. I know, it makes me, it's, it's a silly thing. But it makes me happy and I think that's exactly what we're gonna do. It's gonna be amazing. But yeah, I'm gonna actually just, in this one here, we're gonna wait until these guys finish picking this green. Because I don't want to waste 16 green for nothing. I know it's probably a bad idea in the whole scheme of things. Like waiting for this tiny bit of green to get picked. But I just, I just like it more that way, so that's exactly what I'm gonna do. And then I'm gonna set up another grain mill. Actually, we might want to set up several grain mills, because this it seems to be going real fast. We might want to have like, the ability to expand them easily. We might want to just clear out this forest. It's gonna be expensive though. I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what we'll do. But yeah, I'm gonna actually just end this video here. Thank you all so much for watching. My name's been Twisted from Honey Games. Now we'll see you next time.